Hello there. My name is Richard Cadell, and you're just about to see some classic sooty episodes that have never ever been seen before. I'm very proud to be the current presenter of the show, having taken over from Matthew Corbett and, of course, his father, the great Harry Corbett, the creator of Sooty, and you're looking at part of Harry's archive, which I now own. Let me tell you a little bit about these films. It was on digging through this archive that we discovered these film canisters. And I gave Matthew Corbett a call and I asked him what these films were all about. And he explained to me that Harry, many years ago, had been approached by an American television producer who convinced Harry to invest money in producing these films in order to break Sooty as a huge star in the States. Well, that producer died just before these films were completed and nobody could resurrect the deal. And Harry was left with a load of episodes that just went on the shelf and have never been seen until now. Do you know what amazes me when I watch these? It's not only Harry's love of the characters that he created, but also the amazing little props and gimmicks that they used. None of which uh, we use today, because of course we rely on TV wizardry, but real things that re really work. They're just amazing. So, it's with great honour that I introduce to you the first of these episodes, and it's uh, the earliest one because it's in black and white. So for the first time in 50 years, let's join Harry and Sooty at Sooty's Engineering Company. We thought as a change this time, we would take you out and let you see some of the wheels of heavy industry turning. So we've brought our cameras along to a, an engineering company, Sooty's Engineering Company Limited, and we thought that first of all you might like to meet the managing director himself. Well, his office is just here, so let's go in, shall we? I'll go first. Well, here we are in the main office, and uh, Mr. Sooty is busy at his typewriter. I'll try and get him to say a few words to you. Uh, Mr. Sooty! Mr. Sooty! Very busy, these big businessmen, you know. I say, Mr. Sooty! Not today. No, but you don't understand. This, this is Sooty! Now, uh, we'd like to ask you a few things about your business, Mr. Sooty, but... No, don't start typing again! Don't go away. Jolly good. Now then, uh, one of the first things we'd like to know about your engineering concern is uh, that, that, that... No, no, Sooty, don't start typing! Oh, any hour now. Just wait a little while longer. We, we shall... Keep quiet a minute. What, what, what for? It... So 
sorry. <sighs> well, we should be able to carry on now. Uh, no, no, sit. Listen, Sooty. Will you stop typing for a minute? Sooty, please. No, 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 don't do that. Look, you... you, you no, Sooty. <laughs> What's that? Sweets coming with the tea? Oh, no. Bye-bye, <laughs> sweep. Tea break now. Would I like a cup? Oh, well, that's very kind of you, sir. Yes, I would. There's a nice snack bar down the road. Well, how do you like that? Is it nice? Good. All right, good. Oh, Sweep's back again. All right, give him the tray. Bye, Sweep. Bye. Mm. Uh, da, da, da. You've hit poor old Sweep now. Anyway, now that you've finished with your tea break, I'd like to ask you a few questions, Sooty. Why don't we go in the works? Well, we may as well. Is it all right if we go in the works? Well, where is it? <clears throat> First door on the right. Well, all right, then. We'll go into the works. It's uh, that away and uh, that away, this away. Anyway, it's first door on the right, so uh, you go first and I'll follow. And thank you for your cooperation, sir. Don't mention it. No, we won't. You go first and I'll follow. Be with you in a minute. Well, here we are in the works, and it's jolly interesting, isn't it? Isn't it wonderful machinery? Anyway, I'm hoping we'll be able to meet one of the skilled operatives and that he'll tell us something about it. Oh, there's a workman coming now. Uh, good morning, sir. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, he's not one of the workmen, he's the foreman. <sighs> You're very much like the managing director, too, aren't you? Anyway, well, the first thing we'd like to ask you is, what exactly do you make in this factory? Ickle ockles? And what on earth are ickle ockles? Oh, you'll show us one later. Well, we'll look forward to seeing that. And what goes on on this bench here? This is where you make the ickles, is it? Well, could we some of the, see some of the work in progress? I'm sure our friends here will be very interested. Jolly good, then. Well, this is uh, ickle making. Oh, yes, yes, uh, working to very fine limits, of course. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Have a feel at it. I'd love to, yes. Oh, yes, sir, yeah, that's beautifully smooth. L lovely. And uh, what what do we do next? Oh, you've got to take it along to the drilling department, have you? You've got to go to the drilling department now. Well, I'll tell you what, sir, <clears throat> you go first and then we'll follow, right? Off we go, then.
You've really got to be expert on this job, haven't you, apparently, Siri? Do we go back to the bench now? All right, come on, then. Now, what happens next, Sooty? Oh, you've got to nail that piece under that piece. I see. Well, we better watch this now, haven't we? <clears throat> I say, Sooty, it's a big enough nail, isn't it? Mind my own business. Oh, terribly sorry. Can he hear us? Oh, thank goodness for that. It's a good job you've got a magic wand in your toolkit. Anyway, get the mic out and then we can press on. Hello? Sure you can hear us? Well, that's all right. Now, we'd better move over, Sooty. Move over. Yes, sir, yes. Uh, he wants me to tell you that in ockle making, the most important thing is to have the tool perfectly sharp. So we've got to go over to the grinding department now. Well, that was absolutely wonderful, Sooty. I did enjoy watching that. It was jolly interesting, wasn't it? Anyway, will you come back to the bench now, Sooty, because there's just one more thing I want to ask you. Uh, is it possible for us to see a completed Iclotl? It is? Oh, that's wonderful, because I'm just dying to see one, aren't you? Oh, here he comes. Goodness me! Is that it? Uh, words, sooty. Oh, wh what exactly does it do? Put it in that bucket of water and listen. All right. And that's it, is it? Well, now you know what an Iglockel is. And with that, we say farewell from the Sooty Engineering Company. Uh, sorry, Limited. Bye-bye, everyone. Bye-bye.
If you like that, let me tell you the best really is yet to come. Do you know, I was rather hoping that Sooty would be here to say hello to you himself. He's normally around. In fact, he's probably in one of these two houses. And if you don't recognise these already, you're going to see them later in one of the films. Let's knock on the door, see if we can get him out. Sooty! Sooty, will you come out here, please? Sooty, are you in there? I'm very surprised at this. Sooty, will you come out here? I don't know where he could be. <laughs> don't do that. Oh, oh, he's here, all right. Uh, yeah, waving at everybody now, are you? Yeah, OK. That'll do for the waving, thank you. Uh, Sooty, Sooty, I was just telling everybody about these amazing films that... Sooty, uh, Sooty, that'll do for the waving, thank you. I was just telling everyone about the amazing... Oi! Yeah, that'll do for the waving, if you don't mind. Anyway, I was just telling everybody about these three films that we've still got left to watch. We've got this one here, look. This is uh, Sooty's Spaceship. This one here, Sooty's Toy Shop. And uh, this one here, Sooty's Garage. Now, my favourite one is, in fact, Sooty's Toy Shop because of all the... Uh... Excuse me. Oi. Just leave those there, if you don't mind. My favourite one is, in fact, Sooty's Toy Shop because of all the gadgets and gimmicks that... Um... <laughs> oh, all right. Just leave, those... leave it there. I was just saying my favourite one is the Toy Shop. You've got something to show me about the Toy Shop episode. Really? Oh, I see. Sooty, the cellar looks very dusty, doesn't it, all these things? Yeah, thank you very much. Right, should we just open the box and have a look inside? Let's have a look here. Wow, and these are the things that were actually used in your toy shop episode, are they? Hey, now I remember this, Sooty. This is the actual stamp album that uh, Harry uses in a few seconds' time. And uh, what's that? We're ready to watch it right now. OK, then, what are we waiting for? Roll the film. Not like that. Oh, hello there. Didn't expect to find you in here. I'm just looking for a present for a little friend of mine. Guess who? <laughs> yes, you're right, Sooty. But don't tell him, will you? It's going to be a surprise. Anyway, it seems to be a very nice shop. But I wonder where the assistant is. Oh, no, not you. Oh, well, we better go see what he's got. Come on. I didn't know you had a toy shop. Oh, I can't keep track of these businesses anyway. But perhaps you can help me. I'm looking for... Sooty, where are you going? Terrible service around here, isn't it? Now, never mind your cash system. Let's have a bit of service around here. That's better. Well, I... Oh, never mind your cash system, Sooty. Oh. Come on. Right. Now, listen. I'm looking for a present for a little friend of mine, and I want it nice and quiet and peaceful and no mess. How old is he? Five years old. What's he like? Well, he's about... Never mind what he's like. That's nothing to do with it. Now, you try and think of something. Snakes and ladders? That's just the thing. Of course. Snakes and ladders. Nice and quiet and peaceful and no mess or anything, is it? It's... it's what, 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 what's going on here? The snakes will be up in a minute. Now, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We don't want real snakes and ladders, thank you. Take that away. Might have known he won't think of something peaceful and quiet. Now, something else, Sooty. What's the water pistol? Oh, no, thank you. He's already got one. And in any case, this shoots twice as far. How do you know it shoots twice as far? <coughs> no! I don't want a demonstration. Now, think of something else with no mess. What? A xylophone? Oh, yes, well, oh, no, no, it's a very nice idea, Sooty, but, uh, I say, Sooty, he's already got his xylophone, thank you. Oh, this is a supermodel. Well, what does this one do that the others don't do? You can play it blindfold with two sticks. Can you? Oh, well, if you play it blindfold with two sticks, it should be worthwhile, shouldn't it? Well, we'll see it anyway, and, uh, uh depends how much it is, of course, but it might be worthwhile. Oh. 
Over here, Sooty. Over here. That's it. Now, here he sticks. Here you are. Now, this this way, Sooty. That's right. Now, come on, now, let's hear you play it. Blindfold with two sticks. Now, no, this, this way. This way. Right? <coughs> was wonderful. I definitely must have that. How much is it? Eight and eleven. Right, oh, then just a minute. <clears throat> there you are. That's only seven and six. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait a minute. I might have known you and your blindfold and two stick you a twist. That's what you are. Let's take that off and think of something else. Blindfold and two sticks. What? Oh, no, 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 Sooty. Anything but that. Take that away. He's already got one, thank you. Come on, think of something else. Got just the thing. I wonder what this is going to be. Not a hammer, I hope. What's this? Junior building kit. Bricks. Oh, that's just the job, Sooty. Nice and quiet and peaceful and no mess. Oh, yes, I'll have that. How much is it? Five pounds? <clears throat> what are they? Gold bricks or something? I better have a look. What's this? Cement. Trowel. Wheelbarrow. And a road drill. Oh, I don't want that. Stop it, um, what are you doing? Stop it. I don't want this sort of a... Stop it, Sooty. Look, no, will you stop it? I don't want this sort of a building kit. I said something nice and peaceful. You'll have to think again. Mm. A stamp album? A stamp album? That's it, Sooty. Gosh, that's the best idea he's had yet, isn't it? Uh, how much is this, Sooty? Four and eleven. Very reasonable. Can I just have a look at the stamps? All right, now then. <coughs> well, there isn't one in it at all. Oh, there's a magic one supplied too. Uh, do you magic your own then, Sooty? Johnny, can we try it then? And. You say the magic spell is he with you? Let's get busy stamps. Right, oh, that's right. Is he with you? Let's get busy stamps. If this works, it'd be... Oh, Sooty, that's wonderful. Oh, yes, I'll definitely have that. Did you say 4 and 11? Right, oh, then. My, well, that's the best thing I've ever come across. Uh, there's five shillings. Can I have a little note? Sure, this is only going to take a minute, Sooty. Oh, well, that's all right then. Wait a minute. Sooty, what's old Sweet doing here? He's the cashier. But, 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 wait a minute, he's asleep. Well, I haven't all day to wait. Look, just you waking him up. Come on, waking him up. That's no good. 
Now, at least I haven't all day to wait around here. Oh. Oh, look, he sent it back without any change. Send it back again. Go on. Now, listen, you. Never mind about going to sleep when you should be working. Get on with my change and make it quick. Oh, there it is, Sooty. Well, here you up now. There. And is this my change? All of it? But I'm more than when I started. <sighs> Listen, Sooty. Just send him the five shillings back and leave the penny here. No, don't, don't send the penny as well. Oh, my... Just forget all about it, will you, please? What are you doing now? A note to explain it or something? Gonna be here all day at this rate. What's this? Please send the tea. Oh no, I haven't time to wait until you've had your tea. Look, Sooty. Oh, Sooty. change. How are you going to get that back now? Honestly, I'm beginning to wish I'd never come into this shop. Oh, now, Sooty, you mustn't start climbing up there. Look, it's not safe. You... <clears throat> oh, no, no, don't put it up there, Sooty. Now, listen. You mustn't climb up there, Sooty. Careful, please. Oh, Sooty, do be careful. <coughs> That's it. Come on back, Sooty. Careful. Oh, you made it. Jolly good. No, Sweep, no. Look out. <coughs> No, no, don't stop fighting. Listen. Oh, say, just a minute. Stop fighting, you two. And just wave bye-bye. Bye-bye, everyone. Bye-bye. <laughs> The immense family appeal of Sooty is still as strong as ever. As well as his successful television and theatre shows, Sooty can be found in a variety of versions in holiday centres and theme parks all across the UK. Here he is at Fun City in Breen Sands, Somerset. Isn't it brilliant to think that the Sooty show has survived for over 60 years? And it's great to see things like this still working on this amusement park. One thing's for sure, Sooty is still a real crowd pleaser. Okay, boys and girls, who wants to meet the real Sooty? Yeah! I tell you what, would you come and knock on the top of the box for me? Just knock on the top. Go on, as hard as you can, see if he pops up. Oh, ho, ho, look! <laughs> it is Sooty, isn't it? Do you want to shake his hand? How about that, then? Oh, <laughs> oh well, and you've got a present for every... He's got a present for everybody. Look at that. You didn't believe that, did you? <laughs> well, what's inside here? Uh, no, no! No! Don't do that! Don't do Don't do Hey, so let's watch another episode. And this is one of my favourites, and it always makes me laugh because, well, you'll see for yourself, Sweep's about to do the long jump. You've never seen anything like it. So let's join Harry and Sooty down on the playing fields because it's time for the Sooty Olympics! Yay! 
Hello there, and welcome to the Sooty Olympic Games. At any moment now, we're expecting Sweet, the Olympic runner, to arrive with a blazing torch when he can light the Olympic flame and declare the Games open. Oh, here he comes now. And here comes Sooty waving him on. Come on, Sweep. <laughs> Jolly good. We're ready? Right, off we go then. He now declares the game's open. Yes. It's gone out, hasn't it? I can see it's gone out. Well, you'll have to run back and get another one, that's all. Huh? Run back and get another one. <laughs> I know it's ten kilometres. <laughs> five kilometres there and five kilometres back. So, all right. Well, go get another one, then. Oh, dear. I Look at the flags. Come on, Sonny. Slim up again. Just a minute. That's funny. Well, I can't understand that. <clears throat> but, oh, never mind, here he comes again. <laughs> Are we ready, then? <laughs> okay, off you go. Hello, Mr. Corbett. Oh, hello, Sue. Oh, sweet, that huh? lane's far too big. Come over here. <laughs> <laughs> yes? It's gone out, doesn't it? Well, you'll have to go get another one. <laughs> I know it's ten kilometres. Five kilometres and five kilometres back, so get going. Go on. Ah, look at the flags again. Come on, Sonny, hoist them up again. I don't know, it gets curiouser and curiouser, does this. But never mind. Oh, he's here again. Now, we should make it this time. Are you ready? Mm. Off you go, then. Mr. Corbett, I've made you a cup oh, of tea. Oh, thank you very much. Mm. Oh, that's just what I wanted. It yes. really is. Oh, I've just realized mm. I put salt in it instead of sugar. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh! Salt! <laughs> oh! Don't tell me it's gone out again. Well, go get another one. I know it's packing it, it's packing it. Oh. <clears throat> go on. Look at the flags again. Come on, Sonny, hoist them up again. Come on, get busy. Just a minute. What is going on here? There's something very strange about this, I must say. Anyway, never mind the sweep here again. Mm. Oh, we're ready now, sweep. <laughs> Jolly good. Off we go, then. <laughs> he now declares the game's open. out again. Where, where did he get this thing from, anyway? Out of the garden? Well, it's your garden found in you, Sammy. Mr. Corbett! I don't know. Mr. Corbett! Oh, what you is seem it? to be having a lot of trouble with the flame, Mr. Corbett. Will this do? Yes. Thank you very much, sir. It's jolly a jolly good me. idea. Mm. Right. Okay. Do your stuff. He now declares the game is open. <laughs> the Sooty Olympic Games are now open, and we are ready for the first exciting track event, the long jump. So let's go and meet our two contestants, Sooty and Sweep. That's right, boys. Plenty of exercise. You've got to keep really fit for this jump. Are you all ready for the long jump now? Are you? Jolly good. Well, I'll just explain what happens. You see, we have two markers here. Now, we put that one there. Now, that's where the jumpers take off. And then they jump over here to a sand pit. Now, I'll just show you. Look, there's, there's the sand pit. 
And then we put the marker where they land there, and then we measure the distance between the two, and it's the best out of three jumps. Right? So who's going to have the first try? <coughs> Uh, well, you can't both. Uh, we'll let Sonny have it. Sonny's first try. <coughs> I'll you that, Sonny. Ready? Oh! My words! And you landed right on the market. So let's measure it up and see how you've gone on. Come on. Gosh, that's a good one. 76 centimetres! <coughs> my words, that was a smash, <coughs> Sonny. Really good. Yeah, can you have your turn? All right, you have your turn now, then, sweet. Come on, sweet's turn now. Oh, dear, dear, dear. Oh, I don't reckon much to that. <laughs> 23 centimetres. <laughs> that wasn't good at all. Now it's Sunny's second try. Come on, Sunny, another go. Ready? I think that was even better than the first one. Right, let's get the measure. Oh, this is bound to be a 23... 23 centimetres. <laughs> oh, so... So, you moved the marker, you naughty lad. That's where it should be. Now let's measure it up again. Hmm. 79 centimetres. Oh, that was pretty. He's broke this first one. Johnny, what? Your second one? All right, then. Let's see if I have another go. <laughs> Can you measure it? All right, you'll measure it. You take, take the measure. Be about 20, 30, 40, 50. Gosh! Gosh! Gosh, it's over two metres. Well, that's up to... Oh, so that's it, is it? You, you are a cheat. It wasn't that at all. It was 23 again. <laughs> no good at all. I thought he's jump number three. A really good one. See if you can break the record this time. Mm. Ready? Up. Oh. That was very naughty, sweet. You pushed him. Anyway, we'll measure it up and see what's happened. You've, you've done him a good turn. He's broke the record. 81 centimetres. Oh, terrific. Marvellous. Yes? Can you break a record? You would never break a record. <coughs> now, so he's a... Not a gramophone record. God. Okay, now you are it. <laughs> now, Sonny's definitely the winner. Well, yeah? One more go. Shall we let him have one more go? All right, one more go then. Sweet. Why don't you take a run at it this time? Not a little stand jump. A run. Go on, a bit further. A bit further. A bit further. Yeah. Where's he gone? Not out of the bedroom window. Come on down, you Sammy. Come, Come on down. He's landing with his head in it this time. Oh, get him out. Don't just stand there, sonny. Get him out. He, he won't come out. What, what are we going to do with him? Get his spade. Get his spade. <laughs> That's it. All right, dig him out, then. <laughs> right, let's try him now. Try, push him, push him. That's it. Are you all right, sweep? <coughs> He's okay. Well, what's the, we'll measure it. Yes, we'll measure it. Just a minute. Just a minute. Let's have a look. 81 centimetres the same as Sooty. It's a draw. It's a draw. Well done. Well, so much for the long jump, but now let's have the tug of war. Get the, get the rope, boys. That's it. I just lay it down here for the moment. There we are. Now, can we have the other contestants, please, for the tug of war? Oh, yes, here's Tiggs, uh, Butch, 
Henry the Dolbot, oh, and Ramsbottom. Are uh, you the anchor man, Henry? Yes, uh, to put the rope round you then. All right, well, uh, I'll take up your positions then. Just a minute, just a minute, that's not right. There's one, two, three, four, five, I'll do one. That's all right. Well, if you say so, okay then. Oh, well, all right, carry on then. Take the strain. Pull! Come on! My gosh, he's holding them! He's holding five of them! I've never seen anything like it! Well, I... Just a minute. Oh, so that's it. You had the rope round a post. Oh, you are a... Now, just you get hold of that. No post this time. And it still isn't right. We can't have five under one. You'll join sweep. Well, you start, right? Because you've got four under two now. It's all right. Four under two it is. Okay. Hey, ready? Take the strain. <coughs> pull! Come on, Sooty, come on, Sweet! Pull! Come on, pull! Bye-bye, <laughs> everyone. Bye-bye. There you go, that was the Sooty Olympics, and as you can now tell, it was filmed on this very set, which was given to Connie Crichton by the Corbetts. Connie was a presenter with Harry for many, many years, and Connie very kindly gave it to me. So it's back with the Corbett collection, isn't it, Sooty? And you're still using it. What are you up to today, then? Got your gardening. Oh, what's next on the agenda? You're going to water the flowers. Oh, that sounds like an idea. Where's your watering can, then? Uh, oh, it's going to go and fetch the... Uh, Oh, the magic wand. Uh-oh. Here we go, then. Get busy. Here we go. Izzy Wizzy, let's get busy. <laughs> oh, I didn't know you were going to water it like that. Well, get, get, get it away from me, then. Water the flowers with it. Go on, that's it. Uh, oh, oh, well, it's certainly grown. I don't know about all this water everywhere. Oh, hello, sweet. Like your new bone? Well, it's a very nice bone, isn't it? What are you doing, Sooty? Sooty, Sooty what are you doing? No, 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 Sooty, no. Oh, just take it off Sweep's bone. And stand still, Sweet. Come on, I'll get it. There we are. Let's, let's, let's... Oh, <laughs> let's put it in the fountain. There we go. Oh, oh. That's more like it, isn't it? Oh, stay away, sweep, stay away from it. <laughs> it's, look what is happening now. Stand still, sweep, stand still. Let's, let's get... Oh! <laughs> I don't believe... Hey, what's oh, all this dear. noise? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Get it on his head, Sooty. Go on, get it on his head. Oh! oh. <laughs> Let's watch Sooty's birthday. Sooty is having a party today, and I think at the moment is in the kitchen with Sue making a birthday cake. Let's go and see how they're doing. No one here? Well, that's strange. Anyway, I'll show you around until they turn up, so it's sweet and so. Uh, this is their gas oven. Here's the gas cooker, the table where they mix everything. This is the sink. Do you know it's got one of those waste disposal units in it as well? That's the dishwasher, and there's the refrigerator in the corner. I don't know where Sooty and Sweet and Sue are, though. I thought they'd be here. Strange. Oh! <laughs> Hello, Sooty. Hello, Sweet. Hey, I've told you not to bring your dirty bones into the kitchen. Now take it outside and get rid of it. Get rid of it. Go on. Ah, where's well, bringing his dirty old bones in? Yeah, they're mixing bowls, Sooty. That's it. We'll soon have a lovely kick. Sorry, I put 
is this, though? What are we going to put in it? An egg, some flour and sugar and milk. That's a good mixture, that really is. Oh, there's the egg. They'll pop that in. Not with the shell on. You see that? Well, there we are. Now we've got that in. Mm. You put the flour in. I'll put the brown sugar in. So and here's the milk. There we are. You pour that in here. It'll be a nice cake, will this, when it's made. It'll be a little bit gritty with the eggshell, but never mind about that. Hey, come on, I didn't say drink it. Pop it in here. There we are. Lovely. Let's stir it up. That's it. Now, then, we'll give that another stir up, shall we? <coughs> and, er... Uh, hmm. What are we going to do about this bone of his? Put it down the waste disposal unit. <laughs> That's a good idea. Let's put it down the waste disposal unit. Pop it down there. Switch it on. All right, turn it off. Well, that's got rid of his bone. That's settled up. <clears throat> Let's pop this in the oven. <laughs> Good job. What else can we do to help Sue? We'll make the pancakes, that's it. Jolly good idea. Here's a nice little pie. Oh, shut up. And we'll put the mix. Put the mixture in there, thank goodness that's already made. <laughs> lovely. Right, now, oh, this is lovely. Are you going to try and toss it? It's coming along beautifully. Just about ready. There we are, lovely. Mm. Are you, what's that thing you're doing? Never mind, you take this, Sooty, and see if you can toss the pancake. Watch it. Oh, marvellous. Oh! <laughs> Oh, you are a really big one, this a really big one. Oops! Where's that gone? Oh, my God. Look at him. We can't eat the pancake that's been wrapped round your head. What are you doing down there, anyway? Try to get your bone back. You can't get your bone back. It's all ground up now. You've probably ruined the machine. Switch it on, Sonia. Let's listen to it. Hey, look at the dishwasher. Oh my gosh, there he goes, there he goes. You see what you've done? We'll have to get the plumber in now to fix it. You can fix it. Oh no, oh no. Oh, we're in trouble, sweet. We're in trouble again. It's all right now, is it? We'll try it again then. My gosh. Cool. Well, how about that then? Hey, just a minute. Where's the pepper gone? We had a salt and a pepper when we started, and we've only got the salt now. Where's the pepper? <laughs> now, the waste disposal unit. <laughs> oh, <laughs> sweet. Uh, don't start sneezing. Don't, don't start sneezing. Look, you wouldn't make yourself really useful. Well, just disappear for a couple of hours and leave us in peace, will you? Oh, that dog. What are we going to have instead of this pancake now? Uh, make something in the mincing machine. That's a good idea. Make all sorts of lovely things in. What are we going to make, Sooty? Sausages. Sausages. Mm, the magic word. <laughs> Looks as if you've been trying to make one already. This is a sausage skin. Well, we've all got a dish full of meat here, so we'll put that in, Sooty. There we are. <clears throat> now, you can turn that, sweet. Huh? You'll uh, wind the sausages up. Hey, oi, look here. My words, I've never seen one like that before. Keep on winding. My God, the pot. Where's that gone? <laughs> and where's the meat? Hmm. Let's have a look in the end of the mince. You have a look, Sooty, go on. Can you see anything? Can you see anything, sweet? No, but I have a look myself then. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! Oh, very funny. Yes. Well, I'll show you something funny now. Oh, you do look 
smell something burning. Huh? I can smell something burning. The oven! Look at the oven! Oh my gosh, dip, 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 dip it up. Look at that. Burnt to a cinder. Well, what are we going to do with it? That's it, we'll put some opal dust on it. Magic powder, that should fix it. This is Sooty's magic powder. Let's sprinkle a bit of that in. There we are. Marvellous stuff is this. Do you take that down there out of the way, Sooty? Oops. <laughs> Very strong, isn't it? Now, we put this back in the oven. How long will it take, Sooty? Two hours? We can't wait two hours. Look at the time. Oh, he's got his magic wand. Well, how about that? How time flies. Shall we have a look? <coughs> we'll have a look, see what's happened. Oh, look here. So, come and have a look. Oh, isn't that smashing? I tell you what, boys, I've got one, two, three, and see if we can blow the candles yeah. out. You ready? One, two, three, blow. <laughs> Do you know what? It's Sooty's birthday today. He's five years old and he's going to have a party. Let's go along and see what he's doing. There's your birthday present, Sooty, from Sweep and I. We <coughs> hope you like it. <coughs> oh, hello, you three. <coughs> well, nice to see you. Happy birthday, Sooty. I say, what's this? Oh, it's Sooty's birthday present, Mr. Corbett. It's a magic box. A magic box? <coughs> oh, let's try it. Let's see what we can magic. <coughs> Oh, oh, so you've got your magic wand down there, Sooty. Get it, get it up for him, Sweet. That's it, magic wand. But just have a look in the box and see if it's empty first, shall we? Just a minute. Is it, is it empty? Sure. Right, well, we'll put this back in there, then. That's it. Give me the tap with your magic wand. Shall we have a look? Shall we? Oh, right, here we go, then. Just a minute. Oh! Look, look here! It's a hamster! Oh, it's a goody, real hamster goody. suit! Oh, isn't lovely. that lovely? Let's, let's mm. check him out. Oh, yeah. isn't that smashy? Mm. Ah, well, let's put him back in his box down here now. Mm. There we are. <laughs> oh, that's lovely. Um, well, what shall we do now, Sue? Well, I'll go and get the tea ready, Mr. Corbett. Oh, mm. all right then, yeah. Sue. So, so he's going to get the tea then. You go help her. Mm. All right, sweep, off you go then. Well, what a lovely hamster suit. That was beautiful. I said, shall we blow some balloons up until they get back? Here's a nice one. I'll just blow this up. <coughs> no, don't do that. <coughs> no, don't, Sonny. Now, let's blow it up properly. Look at this, isn't that a beauty? Look at the balloon. No, don't pull it! Don't pull it! <laughs> come on down, come on. My <laughs> words, you really did get that. Who's that? Like, see who's at the door, so we go. <coughs> oh, it's Tiggs and Butch. Come on in. Well, nice to see you. You're just in time for the party. That's never mind about blowing up balloons. Shall we play the game? Uh, the game. Uh, so, yeah. come in here. We're going to play a party game. Oh, goody. What shall we play, sweet? <laughs> Musical statue. Oh, that's a nice one. Now, I'll tell you how to do it. Uh, you see, when the music starts, I'll turn the recorder on. When the music starts, you all jig up and down. And then when the music stops, you stay perfectly still. Uh, yeah. You're, you're an expert. He's an expert. Mm. All right, well, you stay perfectly still, and if you move after the music stops, you drop out. Have you got it? Mm. All right, well, I'll turn the music on, then. Here we go. <laughs> what are you doing, sweet? Listen, I told you when the music stops, you've got to stop. You're just keeping on. Let's try it again. Come on. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, stop it. Sweep. Hmm? 
When the music starts, you've got to start. Oh, so we'll have to go. It really will. <laughs> have you got it now? Okay, let's try it again then. Here we go. Like a real soldier. Oh, that, that really was funny, too. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed the party, and we'll see you again soon. Let's try it again. Are you ready?